What is up, Breaking Family? We are here in Target. Yes, we are in the candle aisle because candles smell good. We are not going to waste any time. We are jumping straight into today's video. It is a collaboration with a fellow Pokemon YouTuber, but I'm not going to tell you who it is until we get back to the studio. We are doing the brand new Evolution Challenge. <sighs> That is a good candle. So the rules are quite simple with this evolution challenge and it's pretty fun. So we each have to get six booster packs, but the thing about these booster packs is that each of them have to have at least an Eevee or an evolution in the set. But that's not all. We also have to get a pair of Eevee ears and wear the Eevee ears the entire time we are opening up these booster packs. But how do you win? this challenge. Now, in order to win this evolution challenge, after you open up all your booster packs, you're going to take all the EVs, all the evolutions that you have pulled, you're going to add up the HP of every single one of them. And whoever pulls the most HP, the highest number at the very end is going to be declared the evolution challenge winner. And would you look at that right there? There are the EV ears that are going to be wearing the entire time. Grab some booster packs and then head home. And then I'm going to tell you who we are collaborating with. Breaking family, we are back here at home and I can finally tell you who we are collaborating today with, or should I say spotlighting, because today is another installment in the Spotlight series. That's where I like to collaborate with an up and coming Pokemon YouTuber that I think you need to have on your radar. And today we are spotlighting and collaborating with none other than the amazing Tiger Lily. Now we have spotlighted some amazing Pokemon YouTube creators before here on the series. Edith Nevy, Pat Champ, and Tiger Lily is no different. She is just as amazing and let me tell you how excited I am because on her channel, she does skits. That's right, she does some cool Pokemon skits on her channel in addition to opening up Pokemon cards and they are absolutely so funny and I really get excited about this because um, YouTube used to be very skit heavy and for some reason it's like kind of um, gone out of that mold and so skits aren't as very prominent on YouTube anymore but Tiger Lily is doing an amazing job with some cool, cool skits, and I highly, highly suggest that you check out her channel. Her link is going to be down in the video description down below, so go and check her out. As of this recording, she is currently at 750 subscribers, and I think the Breaking Family can go and show her some love and support, and let's try to get her up to a thousand subscribers. I think we can do it. I know the Breaking Family always shows their love and support for fellow Pokemon YouTube creators out there, and that's one of the many things that I love about every single one of you. I seriously can't tell you how honored I am to be collaborating with such an amazing content creator, Tiger Lily. So Tiger Lily, thank you so much. So I truly hope that all you girls and guys have been enjoying the Spotlight series where I showcase some up and coming Pokemon YouTube content creators that I enjoy watching, that I want you to have on your radar so you can enjoy watching them as well. And I think there is one thing that is for sure that no matter what Pokemon YouTube channel you're watching, maybe you're watching me on a daily basis, maybe you're watching Leonhart or Dark Ghoul or Bulbador, so many amazing Pokemon YouTube content creators out there. The one thing that is for sure is that we are a community, we are a family together, we all come together and enjoy Pokemon and that is what makes Pokemon so great and it is my absolute favorite thing in the entire world. We need to get to today's challenge, the Evolution Challenge. That's right, we have to try to pull as many Eevees and Evolutions out of six booster packs as possible, all while wearing the coveted Eevee ears that you see right here. Yes, we have to wear these Eevee ears, and if you don't pull any Eevees or Evolutions, then you are considered an imposter, an Eevee imposter, which actually is a ditto. That's right, you'll be considered a ditto posing as an Eevee, and you don't want to be a ditto posing as an Eevee. You want to be a real Eevee, but in order to win, you take all the Eevees and Evolutions that you pulled, you combine the HP total, and whoever has the higher HP at the end of the video wins. And I think I need to pull my chair down a little bit so you can see 
these awesome ears. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Look at those awesome ears. Had to do that awkward, like, jump up and down to get the chair to go down. All right, here we go. Now, we had to make sure that we bought sets that contained Eevees and Eeveelutions, because if you didn't buy sets that contained them, then um, you would definitely not be winning. So, I had to go with what I could actually find in my target. Most of my, my target had mostly just Lost Thunder, which I don't have a problem with, but um, it definitely made it very hard for this challenge. So we got some Lost Thunder, which does have Eevees and Espeons and Umbreons in it. There is the Alolan Executor alternate art, or you can call it a promo if you want to. And... Do I give you the code card? Of course, I always give you the code cards in every single video because you deserve them. That's right, you deserve them. Oh, I better not jump into singing because it could be, this video could go downhill very, very fast. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and open up these sun and moon ones as well so we don't have to worry about the packaging and we can just get straight to it. Throw trash on the ground, World Tour 2018. We won't be able to do that for too much longer. Now we do have a Pikachu coin right here inside of the Sun and Moon 3-pack. I feel like I haven't bought a Sun and Moon 3-pack in a long time. And we have a nice Togedemaru promo inside of that one along with the Pokemon TCG online code card. And the coin inside the other one was some nice legendary Ho-Oh bird action. There we go. Bird is the word. I don't know how well you can see that, but there it is. Put that there, and I'll put that there. All right. Six booster packs total. Let's see who is going to win today. Is it going to be Real Breaking Nate, or is it going to be the amazing Tiger Lily? And like I said, you can go watch her challenge down in the video description down below. There is a link to her channel, and make sure you check it out. And then, of course, in the comment section, as always, let us know um, who you think had the best pulls or your favorite pull from the video. All right, here we go. Jumping into it, we have an Alolan Diglett. I love the three little hairs on there, even though it is stealing Psyduck's Thunder. Alolan Meowth Growlithe. Put that energy in my filing cabinet right back there. Hypno Switch. And if I don't pull any uh, good cards, I'm going to be switching um, my bad cards with Tiger Lily's good cards. Uh, Reverse Hello Parasect and a Decidueye just pointing off into the yonder. Maybe it's pointing to where the good cards are at. Decidueye is a good card. I'll take that. Then there's the code card for that one. So we definitely had a lot of grass Pokemon action inside of that booster pack. You know what I think we should do? I think we should do a little back and forth action. So um, Lost Thunder, Sun and Moon, Lost Thunder, Sun and Moon. You know that way. All right. Let's see what we got inside of Lost Thunder, the new Pokemon card set. Maybe we can get ourselves an Ultra Rare inside of this. Now, there is not an Ultra Rare Eevee or Eeveelution inside of this set, which, by the way, speaking of Ultra Rare Eevees and Eeveelutions, there is an Eevee GX officially coming out here very soon. I think February 2019 is the release date. Ninjask, Magirna, Reverse Hello, Heracross, and... an Electivire, which now you can get in Pokemon Go. Have you gotten one yet? That is the question right there. And there is the code card. I'm trying to figure out what to use my Sonoa Stone for. Um, I think I'm going for probably Weevil or or Tokiss. I think those are... It's, it's a toss-up between the two. It's a toss-up between the two, honestly, right now. I don't know which one to get as my with using my first stone. So trying to decide. If you have any suggestions, I would definitely love to hear down below. Dewpider, we don't like spiders in this house. Alolan Meowth, Rock and Roller, Growlithe, Cosmog, Energy, Passimian, Rotom Dex. We got Pokemaka Maka Maka, Carvana, Unana, and a Hollow Dragonite. So our first Hollow pull. I don't think we have pulled an Eevee or an Eeveelution so far. So that would bring our HP count to, let me add that up. Um, carry the two, uh, subtract four, divide it by six, times 400, zero. We are at zero. That was, yeah. Oh, wait, no, I forgot. Carry, carry the one. Yeah, zero. We are officially at zero HP right now. I don't want to be, I don't want to be an Eevee imposter. I don't want to be an Eevee imposter. I want to be, I want to be a real Eevee. 
All right, we have a Chansey, a Trico falling out of a tree. I don't know if you've ever noticed that artwork, but the Trico is falling out of a tree. Pick a pack and what do birds do? Fly away, bird, fly away. Scyther, Stunfisk, Energy. I put that in my filing cabinet right back there. Sightseer, Whitney. There is a full art Whitney in the set, which I'd like to pull. Flying Squirrel, Genesect GX. We got ourselves an ultra rare pull. Nice. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve that up. And use my uh, my elite trainer box sleeves right there. You can see nice ultra rare pull. Even though our HP count still stands at zero, you know I'm more than happy to pull an ultra rare in my life. All right, two booster packs left. Let's see if we can do it. Rub my EV ears for good luck, and I'll boop my own snoop. Boop. Since technically I'm an EV right now, I turned into an EV for the day. I am officially an EV. For the day. I should walk around like this for the rest of the day. Hmm. Watch tomorrow's YouTube video. <laughs> no, no. Well, I don't know. Maybe I will. I don't know. We'll find out. All right, let's see what we got here. Growlithe, Crab Brawler, Marini, Rock and Rolla, which always reminds me of Legend of Zelda. I don't know why. It gives me those Legend of Zelda vibes. Golbat, Repel, Pinsir, Reverse Allo, Surskit, and a Cloister is the rare. And there is the code card right there. I have pulled no Eevees, no Eeveelutions yet. All right, one booster pack left. Let's see if we can do it. Let's see if we can do it. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got here. Four and two. Of course, Black Friday is this weekend. I will be doing a nice Black Friday video, so make sure you tune in for some uh, Pokemon Black Friday fun and shopping. Marini, Energy, Fairy Charm, Hitmontop, Faba, Fabalos, Reverse Hello Wormpole, and a Mill Tank is our rare. We didn't pull any Eevees or Eeveelutions. That means I'm officially an Eevee imposter. I am. A ditto. Don't forget to head over to Tiger Lily's channel. The link is down in the video description down below. See if maybe she got some Eevees or if she turned out to be an Eevee imposter as well. A ditto. I don't know. I'll find out the same time you do. I love every single one of you. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to come have some Pokemon fun with me. Once again, I love every single one of you and I will see all of you, all of you amazing people in the next video. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.